What's up guys, David here. Today I'm going to show you how to add floors to your project in Revit. First what you want to do is click first floor and then find the floor option and click it and it will bring you into the create floor boundary mode and now you have a bunch of different tools here that you can use. So you can either use the pick walls tool which is the easiest or you can use um, the line tool or the pick line tool or if you have a square you can just use a rectangle tool but what you want to do is just make sure this dotted blue line is on the inside of your wall not the outside and then just click every one of your walls all the way around oh. make sure you get them all and there you go I now have a closed loop now I'm just gonna click check and then now I can select the type of floor I want so for this one I think I'm going to use a wood finished floor and as you can see it changed to wood but you do not want your floor the same in all areas so maybe you don't want your floor wood in your garage or you don't want your floor wood in your bedroom so instead of drawing your floor in the whole house what you want to do is only draw the floor where you want that specific floor so basically you're just going to be drawing different floors and I will show you that here so I'll click floor and for this I'm just going to make this kitchen area here and I guess the living room and hallway area. I'm gonna make this wood. I'm just gonna close off my loop here. Okay, I'm gonna click check. And I want this one to be wood. And I can go back and change the render appearance later. But now let's say I want a cement floor in my garage. I'm just going to draw my floor separately here. So basically you just draw separate floors wherever you want them. And just make sure that they line up. Then click the check. And this one I want to be a concrete slab. Now in my, house, in my uh, bedroom here, floor, I'm going to want probably a carpet for your bedroom. Bedroom area. But now I don't want to include this bathroom here, so I'm going to go like this, like that, and then I'll just round these off. And click the check. This is going to be carpet. And then now in the two bathroom areas, I want tile. And then for these, I'm just going to use the square tool because they're nice squares. And then I guess for some of these areas, the floor doesn't connect, so I'm going to just move these out a little bit so they do connect. And now, I click the check, I will just make these ceramic. And now you have a bunch of different types of flooring in your house. So that is how you add floors to your house. If this video helped you out, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe for more. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video.